Generic greetings, fellow citizens of the internet. This is me, Raishird, back with another episode of the Daily Minecraft Loaf. Today, I will be watching wheat grow. I'll be right back with you. I don't really want to go off mining and doing stuff on this much hunger, so I'll be waiting for a little while. Be right back! Excellent show! Bloody brilliant! Excellent and marvelous! Let us continue! Maybe this wheat. And. Eh. Loving lag. Grab me some bread. Eat me some bread. Then. Ooh, a bit of replanting. And then come on. Yeah. Um once okay. Yep. There we are. Um and you know what, that was um a solid hour and 15 minutes right there so I'm not gonna stand and wait again that was a bit too much um so I guess I'm gonna go ahead and move on to doing other things if it gets so that my health is or hunger is low enough that I want to you know start worrying about it then I'll go ahead and um, start worrying about it but as it is right now I'm not prepared to really start worrying about it Oh, what am I doing? I need sticks and I need picks and I need a shovel probably because this one's eventually gonna break. Yeah, it's almost broken and then I will start doing some further excavation because we need to do excavation in order to actually get anywhere at this point. Lots of lag, my Goodness me, all right. Um, good times, good times, good times, good times, and good times. No, I'm not doing this right. You know what? I don't really care, I'll fix it later. Um, oh, good, redstone, right off the bat. That's cool, that's awesome. Um, so, um, what's big news? What's big news? What's big news? I don't know. Um, well, as of, you know, a couple days ago, I have a Twitter account, so you can follow me on Twitter. Um, I am Richard, so that would be at sign Richard, I guess, for those of you who are Twitter inclined of, you know, the two or three people who might actually be watching this, iron is always good. Um, then, uh, let's see, what else, what else, um, another pick, and I want to get some light on the subject, my, Jesus, everything, okay, um, what is going on here? <laughs> I'm getting a whole lot of lag, and I'm not particularly happy about it, um, video settings, oh, that would explain it, that, right there. Um, and that's actually a good segue into the other thing that I wanted to talk about, um, which I'm reasonably excited about. Come on, game. I turned you down. Turned the graphics down. Shouldn't be an issue. Okay, Jesus. Okay, just... <sighs> My computer doesn't like me sometimes. Anyway, um, like I was saying, I had the render distance on far, um, because I have been working on a project. Said project is um a custom map which I am working on designing and which is actually in what may end up being something approximating the final stages um it is a custom PvP map sort of thing um it's you know along the general lines of say you know cluster chunker 
uh, PvP capture the monument or something, but it isn't at all. Anyway, um, what it is is basically two teams. I'm, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna try not to get in too much depth because I'm just gonna make it sound stupid or make myself sound stupid. Um, but it is. Um, Good gravy lag. Um, it is basically two teams, um, grass and mycelium, um, each working to get, oh, well then, fine, be that way, bedrock, be right there. Um, so we've got um, two teams, mycelium and grass, each trying to get their respective material, grass or mycelium to the, you know, stone frames that I've set up. And they're both 5x5, five five, so you need to get that much mycelium or that much grass into that area um, without the other team stopping you. And that's, so that's, I don't know what's going on with the lag. Hopefully I'll be able to fix it or something at some point, but I can't make any promises because this is weird. I don't know exactly what's causing it. Um, Anyway, so, um, I want to do some strip mining. I don't know where to start from, though. Um, eh, you know what? Fuck it. Um, I'll just go right here. It seems like as good a place as any. Um, so the two teams each try to get their respective material into, um, the end frame things, um, without getting stopped by the other team. Um, so that's the primary way of winning, or at least one way of winning. The other way to win is um, by killing off or watching, yeah, get killing off the entire other team or watching them get killed off, one way or another. Yeah, something like that. Um, if the if ever, if the entire other team dies, then you win. Um, however, there is kind of a caveat there because if you respawn at a bed, then you can you know keep going and you know. Beds can be used to respawn with impunity as many times as you want. It's just a matter of, you know, cluster chunk style. Yes, I stole this idea directly from cluster chunk. No, I am not proud. Um, if you respawn without a bed, then you respawn up in a um, separate spawn, a separate respawn zone, and you are out of the game. So, um, it's a good idea to make a bed soon rather than later. Um, the map has yet to be tested, um, and I am, you know, I'm hopeful that I'll be able to get to testing it or find people willing to test it for me um, relatively soon. We shall see where that goes. Um, but I am quite excited because it is an interesting idea which seems to have quite a bit of potential and it's gotten something of a community response. Um, and I'll probably slap a link in the description or whatever, so on and so forth. Um, just as soon as I have footage for, um, you know, the testing and so on and so forth, I will probably start, um, making a video, um, about it and, you know, nice, flashy, beautiful, um, spotlight of the map sort of thing. Which I will be posting here on this channel sooner or later once it is finished, but I make no promises. Um, so anyway, that's where I'm at with that. That's a really cool, interesting thing, which hopefully may well even go someplace. Um, and yeah, coal is good. Um, so, oh, anything else of note? I also got a Twitch TV account, which, you know, doesn't exactly matter for much, because I have no idea how to stream, but, um, you know, whatever. It means I can comment and stuff on people's videos, and specific, or, you know, on streams. Add, in, engage in constructive discussion on, you know, the, in the chat rooms, or maybe just, you know, engage in watching people make poop jokes in the chat rooms. <sighs> but anyway, um, so yeah, I'm following Dinnerbone, I'm following Six Alone, I'm following a bunch of um, 
most of the mind crackers so far basically whenever i encounter a mind cracker on twitch i end up following them more redstone i can appreciate this um plus a bunch of i don't know i'm, I'm slowly amassing a decent number of people that i'm following um i have started watching a videos um, videos because you guys all care about exactly what I'm doing with my you know video watching and so on and so forth I've recently started watching a videos stuff and I'll be keeping up with his as well as keeping up with ethos videos and I'm still trying to catch up with Kurt J Mac and you know so on and so forth and etc etc um, continuing on ad infinitum ad nauseum however um, uh, let's see, the... I don't even know what I'm talking about. Um, yeah, I'm following a video just primarily because he started making new series all over the place. Um, that's a funny one. Series-is-is-is. How the hell do you pluralize series? This has bugged me for quite some time, and it'll, you know, probably continue to bug me. Um, it's like series-is. Is, 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 is. How do you... Yeah, whatever. Moving right along. Um, I'm probably going to end up doing a lot of this um, off camera just because it's going to rapidly get on towards the boring side of things um, once I run out of things to say as usual and I don't have that much to talk about in specific. Um, I could discuss... See, last time I discussed a lot of the long-term plans I have and that kind of thing. I could go into more specifics with my mob system, which is probably what I'm going to be building next. I'm going to try and get um, through enough mining to have the resources to begin work on that. Um, I have the food to, you know, <laughs> wait. Take long enough in mining that I have the food in order to... Um, continue with um, that kind of thing. Um, basically the first step will be hollowing out a gigantic area um, on the order of, I'll have to check my notes again, but 20 blocks tall or deep um, by uh, approximately, what was it, like, uh, like 31? block don't quote me I have no idea now um, it's been too long since I've been in the creative world that I was working on this in but it's big it's big and it'll require a lot of space and since I'm doing all this underground it's gonna be a pain in the neck but um, I'll be digging that out um, probably someplace off in that direction I'm thinking like off in that direction off of the main area up there um, and so that should be quite interesting indeed. Um, I've got a design, like I implied, I've got a design worked out, um, which should be reasonably effective. It should get, um, it's, it gets like 40 mob spawning spots per level or something, and it's five high levels. I'm repeating the cylindrical shape, like, f what is it? One, two, three, four, five times four, so it's like, yeah, theoretically it's like 20 times 40 or something. It's a decent number of mob spawning spaces, if I remember correctly, um, and I'll want to revisit all this garbage later. Um, but right now I'm sort of getting ahead of myself, because right now I just need to do some strip mining, and the way I'm planning on doing that, I don't have a good way of doing it. I really don't have a good way of doing it. And usually, ordinarily in my single player worlds, I end up just bumbling about until I hit the resources that I need. But I'm going to try to do it a little more methodically this time. Um, so I'm going to make two by two passageways, um, just arcing off into the darkness. And I'm going to try and hit as many blocks as I can. Um, expose as many blocks as I can. I'll do it like every two every two blocks that makes sense for that and then uh, there's no pleasing down here Ooh, unless I do this hey you know what I, I think I'm uh, yeah you know what haha -ha. look at this 
Look at me, look at me like this. It's not a 2x2 two two like most people usually do when they're strip mining in this style, but that will allow me to uncover more ores, or at least not miss like one row. Because I am that guy, I am that, you know, I have to get it all, I have to be perfect, I have to have everything absolutely perfect. That it, oh. Although there's kind of interference here, and this is not the most efficient way of doing it, now I'm realizing. Eh, you know what? Um, um, it's going to be a pain to dig this out, too. There's coal there. I'll get that in a sec. Um, you know what? <sighs> Forget everything I just said, even though I'm going to hate myself for it, and I'm going to have to probably excavate these rows out individually. Um, I'll just do this and just go with those rows and it'll be a lot easier to mine out and I'll get almost as many spots uncovered. So that's what I'm going to do. And then, uh, at some point I'm going to need to go up for wood, but this should tide me over for a little while. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. I want to do it there. Um, was watching the Mindcrack court cases, court case episodes, watching from Ethos and B double O's perspectives. Uh, that's been quite the interesting controversy. Um, I look forward to seeing where it goes. Um, as of this recording, I'm, this is, um, yeah. Wednesday night or Thursday morning if you want to be technical because it's currently 1.30. Um, yeah, they just did the, um, se they just released the, um, second Mindcrack court case episode and that is quite interesting indeed. Um, no spoilers if people haven't watched it. Ha ha! Because like 90% of my audience, if I ever get an audience, is probably going to be watching this some, you know, months to a year after this posting, so it's not going to be topical anymore, but, you know, whatever. <sighs> Alright, um, I'm actually going to go ahead and shift F3 at this point. Um, where am I at? I'm at 12, whatever, that's good enough. This is 10... And then this is at 13, F14, 15. That's not bad. That's not bad. I'll give me a decent chance for emeralds and so on and so forth. So let's see. Where am I at? Um, this is... I'm looking at my X coordinate right now. And doing that, I get exactly 5. Or like on a multiple of 5. So negative 105. So... I'm going to be to placing torches every five blocks in these um, tunnels, that's why I'm doing that. Um, so that it's absolutely perfect, because that's what I like. Uh, hello redstone, I like you. Uh, that's good, that's good, that's very good. I will have plenty of redstone, and that is a good thing. I like redstone, I like working with redstone, redstone is fun. So, um, once I get done placing these torches, whoa, that was fun. Uh, once I get done placing these torches, I'll be again, you know, doing this in earnest. Um, and I'll probably mine out to, say, negative 100 and... No. Say negative 50x. That's where I'll stop for now. Um, and we'll see where that takes me. Um, actually going to... Do I... I'll make another crafting bench down here. Um, I think it's worth it to have one down here because I'm gonna be probably working down here a considerable amount. And forethought is a good thing, so I think I'm gonna make myself some chests. Not too many chests, though. Look at my wood. Chests, nom wood. Today I learned. Okay, um, then I'm probably gonna want plenty of furnaces to be around. Um, so I can load them up just as soon as I have the minerals to do so. Um, they can go on this wall here. Huzzah!
Jolly good! Ruddy brilliant! That kind of thing. I'm, I'm done insulting the British. Terribly sorry, everyone. Incredibly sorry, I, I don't know what came over me. Moving right along. I guess I will probably be cutting sometime around here, um, and then I will, um, may as well finish up with these initial torches. Then I don't know, I might be using, um, I might be fast forwarding or I might just be cutting, um, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see, um, actually I might just cut. That's what I'll do. Um, so... Going mining! Yeah! Alright, there's a lot of empty space here. And I don't know what to do with it. So I've written a song. A three minute mining song. Welcome to the Daily Minecraft Loaf, Episode 3. We're getting someplace, building stuff and rocking the redstone. Here's a mining clip for y'all with filler audio from your beautiful resident music artist, yours truly, CK. I don't know what to do with all this space. I think the freaking fast motion now. It seems so dumb when it's so quiet. Gotta feel the silence somehow I usually avoid having music in the world So you can play your own if you choose But now it seems I don't really have the option This exception here I hope you excuse Half an hour later, um, approximately, give or take, whatever, um, I have amassed a decent supply of stuff, um, tiny bit of gold, bit of redstone, little bit of lapis, some iron, you know, I think I had a lot of that iron before because I don't remember running across that much, but whatever. Be that as that may, I, actually, you know what, no, I don't remember having any either, so I don't know where it came from. Um, one way or another, um, I got the most redstone, I guess, and I'm actually just fine with that because I have plenty of projects that will use it. Um, so I can get some stuff smelting, um, hang on, hmm, 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 so I can put the redstone in here for safekeeping, um, probably a good idea, then I'll get some 
Meh. Yeah, okay, let's... There we go. That there, then... Save that. Yeah, this can all go in there. And then I guess six, seven, eight. Right there. Then right there. And then finally uh, right there. Now, how perfect is that, folks? Goodness gracious. All over the place. Alright, so, um, my next step will probably be to get more wood because I am fast running out. Ah! Oh, look at this. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I didn't. No. Uh, Alright, um, so I'll make a couple more loaves of bread. Eat so that I am not starving. Um, eat. Yeah, sure, why not. Um, did have an incident with a cave. All the caves that I saw back there were all one cave. And at one point, the first time I encountered the cave, there was a slight mishap with um, Creeper. And um, I lost... I thought I lost one and a half hearts, but apparently I only lost one. Um, mysteries shall be revealed once I review the footage, I suppose. Um, but whatever. Uh, right now, I guess I'll head up to the surface. Don't know what time it is. Hopefully it's not night time. That could very, very easily end badly. Um, so yes indeedy, I... Probably get some wood, and then I'm really not sure. Um, all right, here goes. Hopefully, a creeper doesn't drop on my face. Ah, it's nighttime. Um, hmm, this makes things interesting. Uh, I don't want to stand here like this. Oh, huh. interesting, interesting. You know, I think I'll actually... I don't really want to risk going up at night. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Is it... Those clouds look like a different color. I think it... I, oh, oh, look at that. Look at that sky color right through there. Turn this off, incidentally. Oh, look at that sky color. I'm getting really, really lucky right now. I am a happy person. I still want to be really, really careful and cautious and stuff and not just sort of stand here, right? That creeper bait right here. Good. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Good job, Raishir. Good job. Good job keeping yourself safe and avoiding mishap. Um, is there anything around? So much lag! <sighs> okay, okay. Not a problem. Not a problem. I'll... It is a problem, but I'll pretend it's not. I don't know why it is. <laughs> Terribly sorry, everyone. I know this looks incredibly professional and so on and so forth. But whatever. Um, at least this morning. At least this morning. I'm very happy about that. And frankly, I'm, yeah, I'm very happy. I could not possibly have timed that better if I had meant to. And honestly, I didn't somehow plan that. Um, yeah. I've easily fallen down my hole again. Okay, so I want to um, gather some, yeah, gather some wood and probably snag some saplings, which I neglected to do last time. Then once I've got some space cleared out, um, I can clear out just a bit of extra space and have um, area for a farm. So. Um, ha, look at my achievements. Yeah, see, I was, um, I was working with, um, single player commands, um, to work on the map, a uh, custom map, grass, my, grass versus mycelium map thing, um, and so I was replacing my dot jar file. Oh, that's right, I forgot the jungles did that. It confused me for a second, I thought it was, I thought I was on top of a, 
full tree. Ow! I'm... I'm an idiot. It's okay. It's okay. I recognize I'm an idiot. I know I'm an idiot. You don't have to tell me. If you if it, if it makes you feel better, you can tell me in the comments that I'm an idiot. But believe me, I know it. Um... Yeah, I'm tempted to say I'll just cut away here, but I'm also trying to keep an eye on the video length, and I honestly, I don't know exactly how long I was mining. So, I don't really know how long I've been going for, or how much longer I should make this episode in order for it to be a full episode. Um, so I might actually plan on doing this in multiple parts, and, um, like going off and, re going off and doing some editing. Um, why am I doing that with a shovel? Why would I break leaves with a shovel? Why, why did my brain think that was a great idea? Okay. Ha! Ah, my train of thought. Um, yeah. Anyway, um, I might just go off and edit this, see where I'm at right now, and then come back if I need more footage. Um, otherwise, um... Otherwise, I guess I'm more or less all set here. And in that case, um, yeah, well, I'll see you back, um, later in just a bit. Or, alternatively, see you later, folks.